morning, my name is Mel Colley from My Plant is Cornwall and I just wanted to introduce you to my lovely mum who doesn't live in Cornwall unfortunately, she lives in lovely Brighton instead but she's come to visit for a little while and while she's here I wanted to do a little video um, to show you something that we were talking about the other day, the winging of the um, scapula, when the scapula starts to lift off the rib cage, and you can start to see it lifting off the ribs and you can get your fingers underneath the, the shoulder blade. So it's all to do with the weakness in the serratus anterior muscle. So I'm going to show you what it looks like and uh, what we can do to correct it. So, my lovely mum here, bless her, I've bribed her with Cornish clotted cream, <laughs> lots of cream teas, um, to do the video. So we're gonna, I'm going to come and grab the camera, she's going to stand up and I'll grab the camera and show you a close up of her shoulder, it's on her right side. So you stand up for me and turn around. Lovely, I'll come and grab the camera. <laughs> Excellent. Okay, so I'm just going to take her lovely top across to the side and then you can see here the shoulder blade. Lovely, and if you can just see my finger here, my index finger, and my um, and this longest finger tucking underneath the shoulder blade, and that's what we mean by the winging of the scapula. Even without me touching or putting my fingers near the shoulder blade, you can see that it's lifting off the rib cage. Um, and if I look to the other side, it's winging slightly, but not as much on the left hand side. So she's got more of a weakness in the right side of the scapula and a little bit of tightness and rotation on the shoulder as well, which means the pecs are tight in the front of the body, um, and which contributes to the, the weakness of the rhomboids as well, in the middle and lower traps, and the lats. So, what do we do about it? So I'm gonna ask my mum to take her arms out in front, her palms face each other, lovely, a little bit lower so they're not as too high, lovely. And she's going to, with her little fingers, she's going to feel as if she's reaching in front of her with her little fingers. Lovely. And then the scapula start to draw away from each other. And then slowly come back. Very slowly. Lovely. And then lengthen away again with those little fingers. And you feel as if the scapula is just pulling around the arms. And then slowly come back. Bring drawing together. Lovely. And lengthening away again. Lovely. And then slowly drawing back together. Lovely. And then relax. So she's going to, with her right hand, she's going to reach down and grab that weight that's on the reformer there. It's only one and a half kilos. She's going to take that arm out to the side. Lovely. We haven't practiced at all, have we? <laughs> and she's going to start to lift her arm up towards the ceiling, keeping the head in the center. Lovely. And then she's going to bring the arm back down to her side and then lift it back up again. Now we're doing this standing just for the ease of the video, but you can do it seated, sitting on a stability ball adds a little bit of extra um, challenge for your stability as well. You have two, four, two more for me? Lovely, can you see how we're getting a little bit of compensation going on in the shoulders? So just keep sliding your shoulder down and the head stays centered so the ear doesn't come towards the arm. The arm lifts up towards the ear. Come back towards my hand here with your head, lovely. Brilliant. And relax your arm down by your side. So there we go. That's what, um, you can look towards the, the mirror now and say goodbye. That's what this here. That's what it looks like. <laughs> That's what a scapular winging um, shoulder blade looks like. Um, so uh, just wanted to show you. Okay, thank you very much for watching. And uh, have a look at it in your clients. Or if you're not quite sure if you've got one yourself, get your plant to have a look at your shoulder blades and see if you can get the fingers underneath. And you'll know that your serratus anterior is a little bit weak. Thanks for watching. It's Mel Colley from My Pilates Corner with my lovely mum. Take care. Bye.